All versus rising, my soul family. All versus rising. Now, you know, what I just did right there, that's basically that's basically my martial art message to any narcissistic, soulless, vibrational internet thug, gang stalker that always want to go to spiritual beings' YouTube pages and threat them in the YouTube comments. And you, and you know, it's, I, my, my eyes is literally piercing the screen when I'm making this video, right? I'm piercing the screen because my, my eye-piercing stare is a stare that hits way harder than any punch that I throw, right? So a lot of these soulless vibrational internet thugs that, that be hating on these soulful vibrational beings, they really make me sick because let me tell you something, man. Like these soulless vibrational gang stalkers who be internet thugs threatening these spiritual beings on YouTube channels, man. As soon as they see a spiritual being's martial arts skills, they be quiet. They be spooked for the rest of their their lifetime. And really, these soulless vibrational beings don't have a lifetime. Because let me tell you something, man. I have been threatened by a lot of internet thugs on YouTube for a long time, right? As soon as I started doing martial art videos, for those that have seen my martial art videos on my YouTube channel of Jewels of the Universe 21, you notice, you notice a lot of my narcissistic gang stalkers never said shit towards it because they know, they know they have seen it and they know not to fuck with me anymore, right? Just like Tyson Steele and fucking Rice's Trello. And I made two videos about their narcissistic asses. Because they, they have threatened me one time talking about they gonna stump me out if they saw me and I don't even know who the fuck they are. Which is very sad, right? Let me tell you something, man. Any narcissistic gang stalker that that truly has a problem with a soulful vibrational spiritual being on YouTube or any social media, they would have had a fucking pay-per-view fight like KSI versus the Logan Paul and Jake Paul brothers. KSI and fucking Logan Paul have have fights in the ring. And they're social media influencers. So these narcissistic gang stalkers who be gang stalking these spiritual beings on YouTube, since they since these narcissists, they know they got a social media, but they don't want to get embarrassed on TV and be a, and be a meme for the rest of their lifetime. You know, dealing with spiritual beings that they got whooped by. You know what I'm saying? Because a lot of these narcissistic gang stalkers, right? They have threatened me on my YouTube channel. Talking about they gonna stomp me out like those Rice's Trailer and Tyson Steel bitch ass motherfuckers. But they never challenged me to a pay per view fight on some KSI versus Logan Paul type deal because they know if they was to show their face of who they was in the ring and they get their ass destroyed and erased by me, they will be embarrassed for the rest of their life. It always be these YouTube accounts that try to gang stalk me and threaten me on my YouTube channel. Try to try to zap me of my soulful energy to make themselves feel better. Like a bitch ass fucking weaklings that they are. You know? Because spiritual beings, the we 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 be having knockout power. We have knockout erasure power. So if a narcissistic demonic male or a narcissistic demonic female of, the, of these fucking slave owner draconian life forms want to try to step to spiritual beings like me in the fucking ring and they get dropped on pay-per-view and I get paid to whoop a narcissist ass oh I'm gonna be happy as shit because for one I embarrass a narcissist on public TV by beating their ass with, with the fucking knockout power of erasure right so like and this is my message standing up to all the spiritual beings on this on YouTube or in all corporate social medias. Like you soulless vibrational gang stalkers who want to threat spiritual beings on YouTube and whatever. Just know us spiritual beings, we are martial art warriors and we will fucking erase you. You know what I'm saying? We'll fucking erase you, boy. We'll fucking erase you, bro. I'm telling you, man. Because look, man, all the martial art videos I've done, all these narcissistic internet thug gang stalkers who had threatened me in the comment section, they knew to go past them videos because they know, they know, they know I leave them spook. I left all my fucking narcissistic gang stalkers spook when I be calling them out, when I be exposing they fucking matrix, exposing everything that these narcissistic demon demonic. Gang stalkers be doing, man. I'm telling you, bro. Like, seriously. Seriously, bro. Seriously, bro.
Because after these narcissistic gang stalkers have seen memes that I have unleashed on video, oh, they don't want no pay-per-view fight. I'm telling you. Because they know, they narcissists know they'll get embarrassed by spiritual beings on public TV and, and public social media if they fight in the ring for money on a pay-per-view fight versus a spiritual being that they be, that they gang stalk and been so much of an internet thug towards for for longevity and they get put to fucking sleep of erasure they get put out of existence by a spiritual being on TV in the ring boy that's going to be sweet victory towards spiritual beings and it's going to be nothing but pain to these narcissistic demons man you feel what I'm saying so like after this video I know for a fact the internet thugs who have threatened to stump me out. You don't want to fuck with me now. Ever since you saw that I can do this. You saw that I can kick and punch. You feel what I'm saying? I know Tyson Steele and Rice's trailer and all these rest of these narcissistic internet thugs. They not fucking with me or fucking with any spiritual being that they try to test on, on YouTube or any social media. Because they know they ass will be erased in the fucking boxing ring in a pay-per-view fight. Trying to fuck with trying to fuck with spiritual beings, man.